All right, we're back. We are going to try see if we can bounce back here against Green Bay. Uh, there is potential. We're home. That gives us a little bit of an advantage. We'll see what we can do. Probably better than the It's Madden in it. Well, second game was a lot better. First one was brutal. No score just yet in this first quarter of action, but we have the offense in the red zone as they've got it here first and ten. And he gets it inside the ten to the nine. Another good gain. That's now 35 yards combined on those last two plays. So first and goal from the nine-yard line. They'll run with Cook. And he'll work his way closer to the goal line as he's got five down to the three. So the ball position now at the three. Here's second and goal. They'll set up to throw. And in for the Buccaneers touchdown. Mike. A pretty big early test for the defense coming up. What can they dial up here to try and thwart this third down situation? Bridgewater. That one thrown away. After one, seven, nothing on EA Sports. Let's get back into the action. The situation, ball in the red zone. It's second down, and the defense needing to step up. A jet sweep, Dobbs. Nine yards on the play there, and it sets him up first and goal. Well, we've seen running backs in today's NFL get involved in the passing game. Maybe it's about time more receivers like that get involved in the running game. And that is something we are seeing more and more in this league. No question about it. And a second effort gets it in. Touchdown, Packer. We have a first down coming up in the red zone. In fact, it's a first and goal situation as this offense looks to get into the end zone from about nine yards out. And he will maneuver his way down to about the seven. The line of scrimmage, the seven now on second and goal. They try again with Cook. And he'll be stopped just outside the five at the six. Only a yard there, and that'll bring us to third and goal. Defensively, I think they can smell a stop. Ball right around the five here brings up third. And I think what they've done is they put doubt in the minds of the offensive guys. What do we do? Because now you don't have a go-to play. Either side they pick, throwing it, running it, it won't be easy. Meanwhile, on third down, they take a shot at the end zone, but it's incomplete. Blankenship's kick is good. And they take the lead here now at 10 to seven. So golden field position there in squad. So right here, this offense is trying to tack on to their lead in the second quarter with an upcoming field goal attempt. Blankenship's kick is good. And the lead stretches to six here. It's 13-7. So they're able to end that drive with three points. And Time to jump back in. This defense, they're in a little bit of dire straits here as they'll come out and see what they... And down he goes. Pressure gets him back at the 14. Now the Packers going to burn their third and final timeout as they stop it with 16 seconds to go in half number one. He'll drop this underneath for Jones. And now they're inside the 10 as he's brought down at the 9. So we've hit him, and we will skip the highlight show this week. Get right back to this week three matchup. Let's, uh, we're going to throw it short. I'm going to say defend medium. Welcome back. Halftime over. We are ready for quarter number three. Alongside Charles Davis, I'm Brandon Gordon. The Bucks with a lead, and they'll get the football first as the second half is underway. 
and able to get this across the 20, but not much further as he's dropped it to 23 yard line. So here are the Bucks to take over on offense. Which is kind of why I wanted to pick him up, because I knew I had a, a good chance. So a big third down coming up here for the defense, trying to preserve a very slim lead in the third quarter. Throwing there, but this pass is going to wind up incomplete. A big play coming up for this defensive unit. They're down, but just by a bit on the scoreboard. Can they get this third down stop in the third quarter? Oh, he's got Oh, that was a good play call. Dalvin this offense has marched the ball down sense. the field nicely. In good position, can they finish the drive off? First and ten in the red zone. Throwing on first down, but this one winds up to be incomplete. So after the incompletion on first, now second and ten. Off the play fake, he'll look to throw. Across the formation, he finds Godwin. And the Buccaneers are going to be looking at first and goal as they move this down to the four-yard line. So first and goal, six points here would go a long way toward wrapping this one up. Cook, he is going nowhere in a hurry as he is going to lose yardage here in a big way. That's going to wind up a loss of a full three yards on first down. If nothing else, they've already taken a couple minutes off the clock here already as they come up second down. They'll look to throw here. And look at this. They get the turnover they needed. It's intercepted. Devondre Campbell, the linebacker, picks it. And the Packers. We drop you back into the action in a one-score game. This defense needs to get a stop. They need to get the ball back to their offense and get down and score. And now a throw on first down there, but it's incomplete. So a line of scrimmage still at 39 on second and 10. Here's Bridgewater. This one swung out here to Jones. And they're going to work this down to about the 32-yard line. He's already proven to be a factor in the running game on this drive. Now he gets involved in the passing game. I think what we're seeing here is the modern version of workhorse in the NFL, being able to run it and catch it with equal proficiency. And they'll work this down inside the 30. Good reactions there defensively. That screen was a little slow in developing, and they shut that one down with a little game. Fourth quarter, down to the final two minutes, and we've got a one-score game. So it's Packer football here as we welcome you back. And they've got a fourth down now in a game that, to be honest, has been pretty much everything we could have asked for. And he will not even make it back to the line of scrimmage. They had to go. They start the drive with Cook. And not much of an opening there as he's only going to get this to about the 32. And whistles, and we're going to have another stoppage of play as they call the timeout on defense with 1.53 left. And he's going to have to protect the football and take his lumps here at this stage of the game as they stop him behind the line. Now the Packers going to go ahead and use the second of their timeouts as they'll head to the sideline and talk over what to do next. And he's going to come up a few yards short of the first. They get him to the ground at the 37. Here comes the Buccaneers punter now. He's been terrific so far. And he deserves a bronze leg as he gets this one away. Here comes Reed. Call that a punt of 38 <laughs> yards officially. And Ross just wraps him up like smack him. Down at 10. Close my I don't know. Here's Bridgewater. Now a desperation throw deep downfield. And oh, that one nearly intercepted. That would have sealed it. Instead, it'll be second down. Bridgewater. And he can't get a throw off. He's taken down. What a huge play at this point in the game. To Dobbs, and he hauls it in. And they'll bring him down at the 27-yard line. Got to be careful here. They need to move quickly, but it's also fourth. 
<laughs> now they go for it on fourth, but this one is going to wind up incomplete. This is one of those games where if you win, it feels extra special. But to lose a close one like this, Charles, remember where they didn't see. But it worked. I think I only threw one pick. That's better than all the other games. I probably threw a season's worth of picks in two fucking games. Now, does Johnny have anything? No. Okay. <laughs> so, I don't, I don't know what I'm going to do about that. Oh, man, I got the Chiefs next. Ugh. Oh, all right, one of them. <laughs> It'll be a tough one. Definitely ain't gonna be a uh, an easy game. I can tell you that it's gonna be tough. It's uh, all right. Let's head on into it. See what we can do. See what we can do against Kansas City. Yeah, at least there in our house. I think that kind of helped us the first time. Cook as they begin on the ground. Oh, He'll work his way up the middle for a gain of about four and second down. The numbers a week ago for Cook. 17 carries, 68 yards. He comes into this one right ninth in the NFL in rushing. I think that every member of that offense knows exactly where he sits. You can see it from every one of them out there. They're all fully committed to making this a game where it really breaks free and climbs a couple of spots. An early task, two plays in. This is third and two. A throw there, but that's going to wind up incomplete. Fourth down, so Jake Camarda is out there. Waiting on it will be Richie James. He punted five times in the win last week as this one's away. So possession goes over here on the... Oh, and Marcus Jones fucking in the clear. The Tampa offense oh, ready to get their drive started. <laughs> and the last drive, the first drive for them, not very good. Three and out. What do they go to here? But you don't look down at your play sheet and say, this is what the problem is. I always find out who my playmakers are. Get the ball in their hands and maybe the offense will move a little bit better. Sometimes it's more important to get it to the right people rather than dialing up the right number. Exactly. More than with the right play, yeah. That too. <laughs> Yeah, this is going to be a Bucks first down as the tackle made it about the 43-yard line. I get his abs back. Here's Cook again. That's good for a Buccaneer first to pick up of 12 yards. Well, one unit I know you want to watch is that offensive line. If they keep clearing holes like that, it could be a long night defensively. No doubt about it, because when they are in sync, as we're seeing so far, with that continuity is there, and you can see that they're playing off of each other while controlling the defensive front linebackers, you're exactly right. It could be a very long night for the defense because someone's going to run for some big yardage. Chuck that at the door. A three-yard pickup on second and four, and now they'll need to convert here on third and a little more than a yard. They'll run it. Here's Cook. And he's going to get to the 31 and not for the first down. They get five out of that one, and it moves the chains. Line of scrimmage, the 31 now on first and 10. From the gun, it's a give to Cook. Nick Bolton there on the tackle. Here's second and nine, just a yard on that last run. The Buccaneers are one and two through the first three weeks of the season. And they got off to the tough 0-2 start, but come off a very important first win of the season last time out. And it's tough when you find yourself in an early season crossroads, but that's exactly where they were. At 0-2, they were thinking, if we fall to 0-3, things can spin out of control. But now at one and two, they shouldn't feel the need to press out there. They're now back in a good spot. Find a way to win some games and keep moving forward. There's a first and 10 at the 14-yard line. Back to the ground. Cook. Calling a gain of four on first, and that'll make it second down. Here's Manziel. Oh, to the end zone, but I knocked away and in incomplete. So after the second down incompletion, they'll come up now against a third and six. They'll look to throw. The quick slant caught. Touchdown! 
Yes, This defense backed up now as they're looking at a first and goal just inside the 10. Now it's Mahomes again. Buying time to his left. And he'll just chuck this one up into row G. It's incomplete. Another shot from the nine on second and goal. Here's a give up the middle. And he takes this into the end zone for a Chiefs touchdown. Coming up here, this defense looking for a third down stop in the second quarter. Here's Mahomes to throw. And he'll look underneath here for Edwards Alaire. And I don't think he got there. No. Just above one minute remaining here in the second quarter. This offense looking to get down at least into field goal range, but they're starting on their own side of the field. He'll rifle this one deep right side. He's got a man complete. Now the Bucks going to use the first of their timeouts as they'll stop it with a tick under a minute to go before half. First down, here's the run with Cook. And nothing doing. He's immediately taken down at the line of scrimmage. Now another timeout called for by the offense as the stoppage will come with a little under a minute to go in this first half. Going across the formation, there's Lawton with it. Now the offense will burn their third and final timeout. And with half time on the horizon, they'll be out of timeouts from here forward. Now Manziel. Now quick throw there, going to be batted away and incomplete. After the incomplete pass here now is second and ten. Manziel. Right there. And he pulls it in for the Buccaneer touchdown. Who that snap that I saw. We drop you into the action here. Neck and neck. Tie game. Third quarter. Third down. Can this defense get the stop? Airing this one out for Evans. And a seven-yard line the catch is made. And he'll be out of bounds. After I saw that shit, I'm a goddamn fool if I did not make that. I'm so mad at myself. Cook up the gut. Give him two yards on that one. Second and goal now. I think that's what my objective needs to be. I need to wear them down. Again, it's Cook. And he's in. Touchdown, Buccaneers. Okay. On second down now, this defense sort of finding themselves with their backs against the wall. Ball in the red zone. To throw again on second down. Mahomes got an open man. It's Valdez Scambling. And they've got this down to about the 12-yard line. From down at the 12, it's first and 10. One back in the backfield, he'll get the carry. And he'll be brought down here at the three-yard line. So not quite a first and goal just yet as they come up now second and inches. And they'll give him another shot here on the ground. And he will take it on in. Chiefs touchdown. We drop you into the action here, neck and neck, tie game, third quarter, third down. This gives me some confidence. I'm hanging in there. Well, this one's getting good now. Fourth quarter, tie game. This defense looking for a huge third down stop. From the gun, it's Mahomes. And he'll be marked down right at the 20 yard line. But when we see the ball tipped in the air, sometimes we get a little roll change, don't we? That's a defensive back. We oh, that bullshit. Yo, yo. That's the thing that... So we have a red zone game. alert. Tie game, game, fourth quarter, game. very likely an exciting yeah. moment in this contest. You know, it's AI. I'm still getting <laughs> And they'll run on the inside handoff. And able to get him down, but he does reach the five. 60 yards rushing for him now with a couple of touchdown runs to boot. A field goal could get him the lead, but it might not be enough here as they come up on first and goal. Looking to throw is Mahomes. 
Come on. Come on. Touchdown, Kansas City. Three blocks that got pushed forward to one. Move towards the ball. What is he doing? He stood there and did it. The key Tell coming you. up here. Preserve the lead for this defense. Fourth quarter, close game. Third down. Here we go. Over the middle, complete. It's Hopkins, and he's going to be brought down at about the 16. White. Come on, come on. And he couldn't quite get there. Tackled down at the one. Oh, what a meet up. A nice pickup of 14, and it moves the stick, sets up a first and goal. Cook will score. Touchdown, Buccaneers. But we are. This defense looking to preserve the tie and try to keep this offense out of field goal range here late. Serious seconds. On first and ten, here's Mahomes. Oh, this is going to be caught along the sidelines. Probably shouldn't have been caught. He's going to lose yardage there. The completion, but they go in the wrong direction. A loss of yards, and now they're dealing with a second and long. From the gun, he'll try to run it. And he's able to get out to the 32, brought down there. They get 11 back on that one. It leads to third down. As big of a play as we've had in this one so far. This is third and three. Mahomes now to throw. He's got his man, Valdez Scantling. Finding room in midfield. Loose inside the 30. The strip animation, they put the fist back. <laughs> I know it's on it. The Bucks offense Sucks set to score. begin their next no. possession. No. And that last drive was very, very balanced, pretty methodical. You think they go that route again? I'm always of the school that until they stop me from doing something, I'm going to continue. And I think that that's exactly what they'll look to do. But the beauty is the balance that they've created sets up opportunities for big plays. Looks like a run, turn it into a play action, and throw one deep. And the catch made by Hopkins. And he's upended at the 33, following a good pickup of eight. Fourth quarter, down to the final two minutes, and we've got a one-score game. So it's Buccaneer football as we welcome you back. This is third and two. Maybe the biggest play in this football game. Third down, here's a run by Cook. And he is going to have the Buccaneers first down by about a yard as they're able to convert on third and two. Back to throw. DeAndre Hopkins making the catch. Now the Bucs going to use the first of their timeouts as they'll get it with just over 90 seconds to go in the ball game. Back to throw. And his throw here is incomplete. An incomplete pass on first down. That leads to a second and ten. He's back to throw. And that is incomplete. Back-to-back oh. -back incompletions, but we know this is definitely four-down territory. Time not on their side. I don't think they want to try and get the first down in two installments. I think they got to go and get it right here, right now. And he'll be brought down with a first down as the tackle's made at the Chiefs' 26. Now another timeout called for by the offense as he'll get a chance to talk it over after picking up the first down. Godwin's got it. Touchdown, Tampa Bay. This defense just one timeout left. This one all but over as we take you down for the final moments. Meanwhile, Mahomes throw on target to James. And he'll be upended at the 28-yard line. Just a three-yard gain there. And this one taken in on the right sideline, but not in the field of play. They say it's incomplete. The throw led him a little too far. It brings up third down. Right end of the line, facing a third and seven, following the incompletion on second down. 
the gun for them. And they're going to get him down well short of the first as he can only get this to the 30. The Bucks forced to use their third and final timeout as the clock will stop with 37 seconds to play. On is the punter Townsend as he gets this one away. Here's Jones on the return. They'll call it a punt of 44 yards. The return was for seven. They'll come out throwing here on first down. Going deep for Hopkins. And oh. incomplete on the deep ball. Damn it. <laughs> So now second and ten after the incompletion on first down. Now back to throw. Complete right side to Ock. And he's able to get this to the 40-yard line before he's out of bounds. A gain there of 30 big ones. The Chiefs will use the first of their timeouts as they get it with 16 seconds remaining on the clock. So here we go. Maybe the biggest kick of the game forthcoming. This to almost certainly win the football game. And this won't get there. Won't be on line either. It's no good. Off to the right. And a costly one there as this game remains tied here in the fourth. I hit it way too early. Not going to pretend to... And time winding down here in this fourth quarter. This is a crucial spot. Let's see what the offense can do. Looking downfield for Godwin. And he knocks the ball away and it falls incomplete. Four quarters not enough for all even and overtime. It's a little teaching moment here. Overtime rules. Remind us how this goes, partner. Okay, so in the past, we had sudden death. First team to score wins, but no longer. Now, if the team receives the ball, scores a touchdown, they win the game. If they kick a field goal, though, or don't score, the other team gets a possession. And after both teams get a possession, then we're into sudden death. First team to score wins the game. And they will play it safe here and bring this one out to the 25. First drive of overtime coming up. So this offense, they could end it if they can punch it into the end zone. A field goal, and the game will continue. They'll start this drive out on the ground. And he'll be brought down shy of the 40 at the 38-yard line. 99 yards on the ground for him so far. A good gain on first. Has him set up with second and just a couple of inches now from the 29. Again, it's Cook. And he'll get it out near the 40 to the 39. Two yards, good enough for a first. It's nice every now and then in this game not to see people overthink it. Just hand it to the old reliable guy, let him pick up the first down. They'll try the middle with Cook. And some room to maneuver. And some good acceleration there as he's across midfield to the 48-yard line. That's good for a Buccaneer first to pick up with 12 yards. Up the middle, it's Cook. And he'll manage to pick up about four. It's second down. Following the pickup of four, here's second and six. Uh, give to Cook out of the gun. And he'll take this close to a first down at the Chiefs 38. Third down, Dalvin Cook. And they'll wind up getting this one all the way down inside the 20. That good for 22 and a first down. From the red zone now, they'll look to throw. And he's got it. And he's into the end zone for the touchdown and the game winner in OT. Charles, normally when you see a group score this many points, it's a complete blow. But instead, they needed every... Fucking... <laughs> that was good. That was real good. Nice. So two wins on that one. Still no upgrades for Johnny Manziel.
two wins. That's a lot better than uh, where I was, for damn sure. Advance to next week. We're now two and two. And uh, we'll see where we go from there. I hope you guys all enjoyed that. I'll see you on the next one. Peace out.